Hello my crafting beauties, I want to show you how to make another DIY using lights because you have requested. This is the spring theme and make sure to subscribe to my channel and add me on my social media for updates for more videos to come. To make this, it's insanely easy that the video is really short. You will need a few supplies, starting with your paper mache letter. All this can be purchased at the craft store and I also have a link down below where you can get it online too. You're going to start by flipping the letter over and make a hole large enough that you can insert your string lights inside. I had some battery operated string lights for my last tutorial so I'm using that but you can also use the typical Christmas lights with the plug-in. Now flip it over and cut the front letter. You're going to remove that top portion following the edge of the mache letter box and also remove the stuffing that's inside. I'm going to toss this out since we don't need it and decided to spray paint this white. I applied the three coats of spray paints, allowing it to dry an hour in between each coat and make sure to spray outside because it's less messy and it's ventilated. I let this dry for about three hours and take this inside. Now I'm going to show you how to insert it, just going from the back and inside the box. Leave a few inches so that you have enough room to plug into your outlet if you have one of those plug-in string lights. And now I'm going to use some hot glue and glue a little bit to the lights and onto the edges of my letter P, like this. For each light that I glued, I held it in place for a good 30 seconds and try to space them out evenly as best as I can. Almost done using the hot glue. The last thing you need to do is add flowers, some artificial ones of course. Glue them inside the mache box. I like to use small flowers to fill up any gap and I'm done. So I place this on the shelf around my crafting area which I'll give you guys a tour pretty soon once it's complete. Look how gorgeous it looks with the glow. You can also hang this on the wall too. Love it, thumbs up, and thank you for all your support in watching my videos. I'll see you in the next tutorial.